the pathway. Oh, pathway. Posterior, pedicatus, medial lindiscal pathway. So the medial lindiscus <laughs> to the thalamus, and the thalamus then sends it on its way. So remember the name of the pathway. That tells you where it goes. Posterior column, medial lindiscus. <laughs> And then we also have the spinal thalamic tract coming in. They come in and what happens? Immediately they synapse. And the second neuron, it's always the second neuron crosses the other side. So it comes in, synapse, the second one crosses the other side, it either goes up anterior or lateral, uh, I mean anterior or laterally, and goes to where? Medulla. No, it already crossed. It doesn't do the medulla. It goes just through the medulla to the thalamus. Thalamus. Thalamus is always the third one, right? Thalamus to the cerebral cortex. Always the third one. So if I cut here, where am I losing from? Same side or opposite side? Opposite side. Opposite side. It came up on that side first. And that would be like pain and temperature, lateral or itch and tickle and things like that. Free nerve endings are like on a sensory neuron. It's, they act like receptors sometimes. So pain and temperature are free nerve endings. They don't have a special, they don't look like, like we saw over there, the thinning corpuscle, that's for pressure. We saw the mysis corpuscle, that's for fine touch and hairless skin. We saw the, no, 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 so the, you saw a receptor, right? You saw something. It's not a free nerve ending. Free nerve ending is just the dendrites. Okay. Right. Mm -hmm. So those are special. Those are fancy ones. But pain and temperature are just free nerve endings. Can I bring something else?